Hey guys, what is up? My name is Patrick and today I have the Backbeat Go Free by Plantronics. This is the Cobalt Blue Edition with the included charging case. So let's see what's inside this box. Looking at the box, it presents the earphones really nicely. The earphones I'm reviewing today are about $130 retail right now. However, if you don't want the battery case, then you can save $30 and pick them up for $100. Opening the flap, you are greeted with your earphones and the charging case. So opening the box it is a pretty satisfying unboxing experience. So inside we have the Backbeat Goes in Cobalt Blue. We have the optional charging case, a standard charging cable, some instruction manuals and also some ear tips. Included are three pairs of ear tips in the sizes small, medium and large. These ear tips have an interesting way of being inserted into the earphone, so it's a good idea not to lose these as finding a replacement might be a bit challenging. The cable has three buttons, the power button that also works as a play and pause button and also a volume up and down button. All these switches are extended so it makes the process of pausing and turning up and down your volume while wearing your earphones just that bit easier. To charge these earphones, there is a port on the right earphone. You simply have to pull off the cap to reveal the plug where you insert the Android cable. These earphones are coated in some technology called the P2i. This is actually a pretty amazing coating. It is water resistant and I've even placed them in the washing machine and actually managed to survive that. Currently there are three color options available. You can get them in cobalt blue, copper gray or granite black. They all look pretty cool and the black one has a matching case with it. So I've been using these earphones for about 4 days now. This case is actually really convenient. I thought this charging case was a bit expensive but I definitely think it's pretty, it's, it's quite worth it. it. Not only does it protect your earphones, it charges them as well at the same time. You can use a portable charger to charge your earphones but then you won't have a case to charge, um, to put them in. But I can say that it is pretty high quality, inside it does look pretty good and there is a braided cable and the cable does seem to be high quality so if you pay the additional cost you'll be getting a decent case for your money. According to Plantronics the battery case gives an additional 13 hours of listening time which translates to uh, two, two full charges of on your back beat goes. So you can charge this an additional two times from 0% from all the way to 100 just with this case two times. So that's a pretty neat feature. Onto the earphones, these earphones are really nice. The logos I'm not so sure with, they do look okay, but I don't know if it was actually necessary to write uh, PLT on the front. If they were just simply plain, that would look pretty cool I think. I'm happy that they're not fingerprint magnets, so that doesn't seem to be a problem, and it does, the caps on these, they do seem to be quite durable and quite, or quite shiny as well. In-ear stabilizers have been an improvement. The noise isolation is quite good, they're not foam tips, so then we do have some sound leaking into them. For silicon tips, the, the noise isolation is pretty decent, uh, it does block out most of the noise that you get from um, going on public transport. And the vocals are pretty crisp. I enjoy that it doesn't put much uh, stress on your ears, you can put them on pretty easily. It takes about like 4 or 5 seconds to put them on, and they are pretty comfortable. You do get a little bit of wire noise when you're, um, especially on your clothing, if you walk around with them. The fit on these fit my ears pretty well and they definitely stay in even if I shake my head a bit. Uh, but it is important that you get the right ear tips for your ears. And lastly, even at very high volumes, if you crank these all the way up to maximum volume, there is no distortion so that's, that's obviously a good thing. If you guys want to purchase these then there's a link in the description below. If you like technology videos like these, then please feel free to subscribe. I'm going to be making more videos soon. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time on Patrick Sacks.